we have a situation in Michigan where a young man who has worked his whole life to pay off his home owns the house all of a sudden gets his house taken from him because he owes on a back tax to the point that the county in Michigan took his house over, get this, what it says in the caption, $8.41 in back taxes. They took his house. Now the county says they are going to do an inquiry and find out why this happened. But I have news for the people of Michigan. You need to take this a little bit higher. State Attorney General, if he is for your side, or if nothing else, I would even go federal. My philosophy on this is simple. I am against property taxes. Property taxes need to be abolished. And until they are abolished, you technically do not own the home. It is in the hands of county officials. And that needs to be immediately reversed. Do not let them play this excuse that they're using it for monetary means to fix the roads. There are other ways. We fixed our roads before the Federal Reserve came along. So why is this a, a validated excuse? Now is this a legitimate mistake? Or are liberals actually in charge of this county in question? This individual lost his house over. This could spark a massive debate. How much power does the liberals and the deep state have to where they are willing to take people's houses over a small amount that they owe on taxes or in some cases possibly even fines now when they talk fines are crossing illegality measures but it would not surprise me if they pull a trick to take people's property over fines folks you need to get this out there far and wide because this is a serious issue when will this stop i will see you in the next video and it is still time to continue to be vigilant folks